Gasparilla is known for the pirates, the floats, and of course, the beads. But some parade goers have a little too much fun getting intoxicated. So this morning, I'm sharing some information to keep all of us safe on the roads. Gasparilla is now the third largest parade in the nation. It's loaded with pirates, beads, and of course, drinking. If you talk to anyone who has received a DUI, it's probably one of the worst experiences of their lives. So beware, pirates. Tampa police will be out in full force. And they will be looking for those drunk drivers. That is, during the parade, after the parade, and into the evening. The best idea is to have a designated driver or take a taxi or a ride sharing service. Uber is partnering up with Captain Morgan to give away $20 ride vouchers to 1,000 people. Just type Pirate Responsibly into your Uber app. Lyft is also an option. And don't forget about responsible boating. Obviously, there's a lot of people out on the water for the invasion. BUIs, our Marine Patrol, the Coast Guard, all of our partners will be out there as well looking for those people boating and drinking. If you want to drink and boat, you can check out a new ride sharing service called Boat Setter, and it can provide a captain. Now, this is the one vehicle that you don't want to be riding in after the parade. Remember, a DUI can cost you thousands of dollars. It could also affect your employment, and it can raise your insurance rates. More importantly, it could affect the lives of others. So remember, have a plan if you plan on drinking. And there's always public transportation. Hart is rolling out more buses. The downtown trolley is free, and the Tico streetcar will take you from Ybor City to downtown Tampa. You know, nowadays we have so many different ways to get around with all the ride sharing, the taxis, mm -hmm. you know, you can do public transportation. There's just no reason to, to drink and drive. And now the boats, you say yes. it's like yeah, Uber for about? boats. It's called Boober? It's, no, it's not called Boober. It's called <laughs> Boat Setter. Oh, boat okay. Setter. But it's like kind of like Airbnb or even Lyft or Uber in, in the sense that you can go online and you can sort of research and pick what you want. And they'll come and get you right at your dock. But you got a capital. Is it pricey or? Uh, it depends. You can yeah. shop around. And different people, if you have a boat, then uh, you can. Can set the price. The probably only captain you're going to get is Captain Morgan, buddy. <laughs> oh, no. Probably cheaper than a DUI, though. Yeah. It's 618. We're going to have uh, great weather.